Okay, guys, I'm back. Another uh, day out here on the spider. Uh, I figured today I would do a thank you video. And it is a, I don't want to say heartfelt, but uh, a very appreciative thank you to uh, the 150 of you that uh, subscribe to my channel. I just want you to know that it is appreciated that uh, you obviously found something in this content that uh, you like and you're uh, willing to hit that little button there and uh, come back for more. You know, it does, uh, you know, it does uh, fill in with a sense of accomplishment, you know, but uh, their, their stuff is getting uh, noticed. You know, I'm not, uh, definitely not chasing monetization and all that nonsense. Not, uh, if you can make extra scratch doing this, that's great. You know, more power to you. But uh, I don't know. Really, it's uh, I came out here just to get the hell out of the house because if you live in the Northeast in the winter, you know that your uh, your daisies on your bike, your trike, or whatever are numbered. And it definitely, uh, the frequency drops precipitously. You know, right now I think it's like almost 50 degrees out. And it's like mid-January already. You know, I just, uh, I just got to make it through February and then it'll, uh, it'll get warmer in March. But it's going to rain like every damn day. Same into April. The only reason I really grabbed the camera today was to uh, reach out to all of you guys and say thank you. You know, if I could uh, influence, let's just say, anything on my channel, uh, I'd be honest with you, I'd like uh, more interaction in the comments section. You know, if you got questions, throw them out there. It's, you know, one of the luxuries of not having a, a really large number of uh, subscribers and stuff is that, uh, you know, I will definitely see every single one of your comments. Uh, okay. YouTube is great to learn stuff, man. And uh, one of the key reasons why the, the video prior to this one was on the install on the, uh, the Garmin XT. Which obviously is not on here today, but uh, yeah, because I did not see a single video on how to install it on this motorcycle. Even the mount itself, and uh, there's no video on, on the uh, store's website. You know, I remember when I uh, was starting to get into photography and... Uh, I would spend hours on YouTube trying to absorb and learn everything that I could, you know, and then once I got my skill level up to a point that uh, my gear wasn't good enough, I upgraded. And of course the same thing happens with vehicles, you know, maybe you start on a Riker, you got comfortable, then you realize that uh, as fun it is, as fun as it is, it's a little limited, you know, and uh, buying the first bike might have uh, sparked some interest in longer trips, longer journeys, etc. So now you need more vehicle. Yeah, there's not going to be a very long ride today because it's, you know, the sun's going down, it's overcast, it's windy. It's not that cold though. Give it that. And I honestly don't know where the hell I'm going. But I'm just cruising. I don't know how many uh, mods are coming down the pike. I know in a couple of months I will be having an extremely long trip coming up. That uh, I will be recording it. And uh, it's 
going to be it's going to be a multi-day uh, extravaganza. So uh, you know, it's going to take me a couple of days after I get back to process everything. So yeah, I will have one of those uh, multi-day excursion series videos, and hopefully you stick around for that. I'm looking forward to the trip myself. I'm not really looking forward to uh, filtering through all the uh, footage I'll be recording. I'm definitely have to bring an external hard drive, that's for sure. And the uh, funny thing is, before uh, <laughs> before I started recording, what uh, what you're seeing, you know, my uh, speakers and my uh, helmet start going off because I got the incoming phone call. Apparently, uh, oh, hello. Well, got distracted. Love that Corvette, man. That is a god awful color, though. And then I was thinking, maybe. Uh, Uh, you'll let me know about whether you think it's worth it or not or I'll just do it I don't know if I get it in a reaction maybe do some gear reviews uh, and I think I might make a couple of how-to videos you know for you guys that are new to these things I think I uh, I think I do have enough miles under my belt to give you some uh, reasonable uh, insights on how to operate this vehicle relatively safely you know if you see room for improvement that let me know I, i'm not uh i'm not opposed to making the experience better for you uh if there's content you want to see let me know if i can make it i will i don't i don't have a problem with that you know you know whatever you suggest um, I might find it just as interesting as you might watching it so that's a good point if there are things you find annoying about the channel hey knock yourself out beat me up a little bit it is what it is will it change probably not yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm actively trying to uh, force down some of my vocalisms which always creep into my videos and it annoys the shit out of me when I watch them you know but if you've never made one of these videos it's really weird when you're sitting here talking to yourself and not sitting here going like this uh, mm, yeah and as you're trying to get your thoughts together <laughs> It's it's difficult because I don't script it. You know, when I hopped on the uh, trike today, I was basically like this. I just wanted to thank you guys and have a chat <laughs> or one-sided chat. You know, once it's uploaded and posted, you guys will, I hope, fill in the second half of the chat down below. Eh, someone's coming up here on a dirt bike. Yeah, so that's let's have a little fun. Go uphill. I don't know what it is. I do like this road. Going through the Hilly section of Staten Island. Granted, I wish I could afford to live up here, but I can't. So, just look at how the other uh, the one percent looks beautiful. Isn't it? There's one other area I want to try to get into today. I just keep forgetting how to access it because it's like a closed loop area. Say it looks nice today. 
I know that I'm gonna try I'm gonna turn the uh, the camera angle to the right when I get home. I just hope you can see over all the brush and crap. I think someone bought this property. Jesus Christ. Can you imagine building a house right there? Foundation can be like five stories down. The truth is on. Yeah, this is a portion of the video where I'm really just I'm riding for myself right now and enjoying my ride. I took that diversion and <laughs> we came right back on the road that I just got off of. It's weird. Ah, that's the guy that went straight. I beat him. <laughs> uh, I, mean, I don't see a lot of mod vids coming in the future. I think the next thing that's going to go on this, uh, this ride here is probably going to be the detachable passenger backrest. Yeah, that might be the next one that gets uh, semi-installed because it is detachable. Because, uh, like I said, I, I'll be, I'm planning on going on a longer trip and I'm going to need a little bit more storage. The F3T doesn't come with the top case, so... We'll give an update on the uh, the backrest. It, I rode a couple of days now with it, and it feels awesome. Definitely happy with my purchase on that one. That's for sure. Absolutely no complaints. I'll tell you this much, it does have the makings of a very nice sunset today. Definitely not taking the highway home. It's been a while since I've been through here. Once you're in here, I don't know how the hell to get out. <laughs> I don't think I've been through here since, uh, watch out, cat. I don't think I've been through here since I got the sway ball upgraded. Too tight here to go. Two nuts. Especially now when all the kids are coming home from school and stuff.
Not for sale if anybody wants it. I think there's only like maybe two or three pieces of that in this entire neighborhood. There's a lot of like switchbacks and stuff. We get spun around here real fast. And I mean, <laughs> all the roads here are like the same. It's just dry place, street. Sidewalks. People could be going on their morning strolls. They're after me, so I think they should be. I think this is the way out. change and avoid all that traffic on the highway. <laughs> Does this look familiar? I guess we're going to take the Skyway back. if there was a place to pull off over here and you know watch the bay but New York City's real estate is far too expensive for such, for such frivolity
going this way now. found the front of this guy's house to be so cool. It's got like an Egyptian motif going on. But I don't know what the hell the rest of his house looks like. Maybe a little trip to Google Maps when I get home. And you could obviously see the house in the background. How huge that thing is. It's got a fringe villa. Let's make a right and take a look what the front of that looks like, because I'm now I'm curious. Damn. Damn. Hope you caught a gander at that. Guys, I think I'm just going to end it here. I'm going to be sitting in traffic for a while. Once again, thank you for the subscribes. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the comments. Much appreciated. Uh, hopefully, uh, you keep coming back. Hopefully, you find my stuff interesting. And, you know, feel free to leave a comment down below and stuff you want to see, stuff you want me to do. All that stuff. I'm open. Alright, so you guys uh, ride safe. And I will see you in the next video. 
whenever that is and whatever that is because I don't know right now so that should prove to be interesting all right goodbye and be safe